Yo, what's up guys? Welcome to a brand new video. I saw that a couple of you guys had some questions with how I make my cutouts and how I make my artwork scenes specifically. So I decided let's just show you guys how to make the perfect cutout to make some freaking nice artworks with. It's really not that difficult, but I understand if you're not experienced with it, it can be a real shit show, so let's just get right into it. But you guys, if you want some more tutorials, if you want some more real nice artworks, be sure to hit that subscribe button and hit that like button, and be sure to comment down below what you really want to see, because I love all the feedback from you guys, but don't forget, if you want some more artworks like the Mohamed Salah and the Kylian Mbappe artwork, be sure to hit that subscribe button be sure to hit that like button and be sure to comment down below because I will do some more for you guys so we just got our picture right here you can just take this from Google images or a real professional site be aware if you want to use it for a professional reason just do not use Google images because you don't have the rights to use it so right now let's just take our pen tool and we're just going to go around every edge that we can find of Zlatan Ibrahimovic this can be really tough to learn. I will put a link in the description down below. That is a game to really master the pen tool of every single Adobe program. So right now, don't pay too much attention about the hair because I did it right here and it's not really necessary because I will show a trick to really master the hair further in this video. So right now the cutout is done, you should see something like this and let's right now just go ahead and click on selection to make it a real selection, you will see something like this right now. Let's right now go into the into the layer mask button, just click it and you will see that we have our cutout. Right now adjust it some more with the select and mask button. We're just going to change the view mode so we can actually see, see what's going on right now. Let's right now change our bus size to something that's just come for the edge and right now just go around the edge of his head. And you see the Adobe Il Intelligence really detects the edge and it's really easy and you have the perfect cutout right now. Right now let's do it with a more difficult cutout, one of Sandro Tonali which is a full body cutout. The trick is kind of the same, just take the pen tool of course, but you have to spend a lot more time because it's a lot more that you have to select right now. But the tool to use it is really the same. Again, if you really want to master the pen tool, I will, I will put a link down below with a link to a game that really teaches you to really master the pen tool. It's not really that hard, but you just have to get the hang of it. Again, don't pay too much attention about the hair, because we will adjust that with the same tool we did earlier. So right now we have our cutout done, of course these are a lot more anchor points and just go ahead and click selection and click the layer mask button. Right now you see that between his legs and between his arm there is still some area of grass and let's right now just use the same trick, use a pen tool to really cover that up. So just go ahead, click the click the selection button and right now let's fill this this area just with some black and it will subtract from your layer mask as you see right here. Right now you still see something on the shoe. Let's just use a lasso tool because it's not really that important for this small of an area. And just fill it with black as well. And right now it's perfect. Right now let's do exactly the same process for his arm. Oh. 
Alright, so right now let's just fill it in with black and we're good to go. Of course we have to adjust this hair because this really does not look very good. Uh, we're just going to do it the same way. We're just going to go select a mask and just of course the view is already adapted. Right now let's make our brush a little bit bigger and just go around every edge and let Adobe Photoshop intelligence do the rest. You see it's not really perfect right now, so we will have to make some adjustments to it later, but it's really not that hard. So right now it's already pretty good. It's not perfect, because you see like some areas on his head are like see-through and that's not supposed to be that way. So let's just change the background color so we can actually see what's not really that good. We're just going to change it with clicking on the layer mask button. And just use a brush to just paint back some areas that we don't want it to leave. So there you have it, we right now have some perfect cutouts of Slatan Ibrahimovic and Sandro Tonali. I'm going to make an artwork with this in a couple of days, so please stay tuned for that. I will do a full tutorial on that as well. So be sure if you want to see that, be sure to hit that subscribe button and hit that like button. And be sure to and be sure to comment down below what you really like about my content. Because I really love all the feedback I get from you guys and it would just mean the world to me. I hope you guys like this content and I will see you guys later.